everybody this is sherry with cpr craft pray repeat and i've got some small notebooks that i want to share with you now i had shared some where i laminated the front cover but i don't know that i can laminate this cover because one it's on watercolor paper and i don't know even though i'm using distress inks i'm not sure if you're able to laminate that because you can't laminate a watercolor project so I'm just I'm kind of confused so I rather than risk ruining my project I did not laminate it which I wish I knew if I could maybe that's something I should ask Tim Holt on the Insta on his own because I follow him on Instagram maybe if I ask him he'll tell me if it's okay to laminate you know my distress inks um but I'll be right back and I'll share my projects with you Alright guys, these are the three that I made. These are three and a half by four and a quarter is the size of the papers on the inside. Now I did cut the, the top cover just a little bit bigger so that, you know, there was a little overhang so it protected the papers a little bit. But, you know, like I said, I, I'm not sure if you can, if you can, um laminate these i wish i had known but on this one i did use a piece of chipboard for the back which gives it a little more stability unlike the one that i made for the chief of police where i laminated it i just i guess it's you know you know you can't you can't germify everything or de-germify everything i guess is the way of putting it but these are just some tilde stamps that I have, and I put them away, so I don't know the names of it. If you're interested, I'll do my best to drag them back out. But I used hot press paper on this one, and was not happy at all with how it turned out. And I'm not sure, even if I bring it up, I'm not sure. But it started to pill right here in the face, and I was really upset. That was my first time trying that paper, and I was not happy. And I bought the same brand that I had bought in the past. This is what I usually use right here. This Strathmore Ready Cut 500 Series Cold Press Premium Paper. Well, here's what I tried. Which was the Strathmore Hot Press 500 Series Premium. So I went from the cold press to the hot press was not happy at all i mean i couldn't believe that it pilled like that i've never i've never had that happen on the cold press so i went back to the cold press and ordered another package of this and thank goodness i got it yesterday because apparently amazon is no longer going to be shipping any non-essential packages and i would have been like really upset to be stuck in here and not be able i guess i could have used my die cuts more but i'd have been bummed because i really want <laughs> i've been really enjoying watercoloring i just wish i knew if i could laminate them that really bothers me now i did do this one as well but this one i used some of the leftover paper so it's smaller this one is a three inch by four inch where this is three and a half by four and a quarter i think which actually i like this size better but my daughter and my son said that they liked this size this is also the cold press paper both of these are so they like this one this size better but i like this size i just think it's cuter maybe i don't know but these are what I've done. These are the things I've been, I've been working on. I've been having a blast playing with them. And just, uh, it's just been really relaxing for me. And just made getting through this being all in the house thing. And I mean, I'm used to having my kids home. So that's not a big deal for me. But, you know, it's just been, it's just been stressful worrying that you can get everything you need for your house and stuff like that but you know what i don't know why i stress because god has never let me down yet and he sure ain't gonna start now in times of trouble people that <laughs> that's the thing it's like you know I, you know it's just silly that i worry when when things that are so non-essential god automatically takes care of for me 
when I truly need him, do you think he's not going to be there? Because that's when he's going to be there the most. You know, I don't know why I do that to myself. And, you know, I guess I need to just learn to have faith and stop being so crazy about stuff. Because, you know what, if we don't have bread, it's okay. I know how to make bread. <laughs> I, I had joked somebody had posted on one of the um, scrapbooking forums, or the crafting things that I follow on Facebook, that, you know, they told their husband if they ran out of craft, or out of toilet paper, that, that you know, it was no big deal. They could use their craft paper. And I was like, oh, heck no, that ain't happening. I was like... I'd be running a hose through the house. My kids would think they had a bidet before I let them touch my craft paper. And I'm like, see? God always finds a way, people. We got a hose. We will be okay. Oh, that's so nasty. I'm sorry. Get your rain yourself back in, Sherry. Okay. This is what I wanted to share with you. I don't know why I brought that up. Oh, I'm so sorry. All right. This is what I wanted to share. But I did want to praise the Lord for always taking care of us. God is so good. He always is so good. I can't even tell you. You know, my husband's very private about our finances. But I will tell you that this week, you know, things were a little tight. And out of the clear blue, there was money in our checking account that he had put in for months ago for reimbursement on something that he did for his work and they kept putting off putting off putting off putting off giving him back his money and then out of the clear blue it showed up just when we needed it the most see god knew when we would need it and he took care of us that's how good my god is all right everybody i won't keep you let me know if you like these if you like this video give it a thumbs up if you have any questions or comments leave them below and if you know that i can watercolor or laminate this watercolor stuff if you'd let me know about that i would appreciate it remember to practice your cpr craft pray repeat thanks for visiting me today and happy crafting love you all bye